Hey loves, welcome back to my channel. If you know welcome, my name is Nano. Um things we're gonna need, we're gonna need a ragtail comb, crochet needles, scissors in the hair. I'm gonna be using the Motown Tress today. It's their um spray and curl curls in the color one and twenty seven. My hair is already part, I'm gonna do a side part. Um so now I'm gonna braid. So we're gonna start braiding. You don't have to be fancy as long as your part, the one that I'm gonna leave out is clean, you're good. Everything else doesn't matter because it's gonna um, cover anyway. So I'm gonna go ahead and braid my hair and I'll be back for the info. Oh, did I say hi? Hi guys. Oh, welcome back to my channel. If you're new, welcome. My name is Nano and in today's video, I'm gonna be showing you guys how I get this crochet hairstyle um so yeah please <laughs> keep on watching Now since I'm going to do a side part, um, that's my part, I'm going to go ahead and connect these two braids, um, this one with the other one, so they can give me one braid, um, if that makes sense, um, so I can do my part. Oh, you guys um when you're doing your braids um your cornrows for crochet hair please don't braid them too tight because it's gonna be uh, um a little bit difficult for you when you're trying to insert um the crochet needles um especially if you're tender headed like me um i cannot uh, um deal with the pain so yeah you want to do them um as loose as you can not too loose but at the same time not too tight okay um trust me it's gonna make your install much easier do a little trimming 
even though that's not the right way, but hey. <laughs> now with the back, you can braid it, um, braid it down, but I'm gonna do the side to side method. And connect them Now that's what we have. I'm gonna go ahead and um, push it down, tuck everything away so we can proceed with the install. Now that's the hair straight out of the um, package but since I'm gonna do a short start I'm gonna go ahead and cut everything in half Now we're gonna start I'm gonna start by wrapping the hair around my finger, my um thumb and my index finger, insert the crochet needle through my hair, open the latch hook, okay, latch the hair, pull through and knot. Now I start with the two knots method but um I realized that I didn't have I didn't have to do the two knots so um yeah insert it Latch the hair on, pull it through, okay, and then knot. It's very easy, you guys. Um, <laughs> yeah. Loop it around my finger, insert the crochet through my hair, latch the hair on, close it, pull it through, and then knot. I hope it um, makes sense to you guys, but if not, there's um, a lot of other videos um, on how to install crochet. Please, y'all can make sure y'all check them out. They're very helpful. Um, so yeah, just in case if um, <laughs> I didn't do a good job with explaining it to you guys, but um, it's very easy. Once you get the hang of it, it's very, very easy to do. It's been a while since I've done crochet hair, um, crochet on myself, but yeah, like I said, when you get the hang of it, um, it's easy. Okay, let's start here. Close it, pull it, and then next. Only um do one knot. And when you doing your edges like your hairline, um when you close um to your edges, please you guys be very very gentle. Cause you don't wanna rip your hair off. That's not what we're doing here, okay? We're trying to keep our edges. Well, I'm trying. <laughs> so, yeah, guys. Um, If you haven't subscribed to my channel, please do so. Now, I'm doing the invisible part. Instead of pulling um two strands, I only want to um, pull one and then not. That's how we're going to be able to hide um our braids, the cornrows. I'm gonna let you guys follow along. Now 
now you want to make sure you install the hair as close as possible when you're doing the invisible method so that's how you're going to be able to cover the track okay you pull one and then next insert the cushion in door pull the hair through okay and then you pull one strand instead of two you pull one and then boom there you have it now that's the 27 you guys um i wanted to do like a highlight a little highlight um so i was like you know what i'm gonna do one row 27 and the other one um with the number one and that's not what happened okay i end up doing a freestyle um i started like that don't get me wrong i started like that but um it wasn't working okay so I had to add um I had to add the twenty seven um where I think I want it. It's like more of a preference if you ask me. So yeah, um keep in mind um if you're trying to do this hairstyle you can add um the highlight wherever you want but I want it on the side so that's what I got. Oh that's what I did. Um so yeah guys. You know you gotta keep on checking to see if if it's in your liking if not you take it out and you do it again Remember, be very careful and gentle when you're doing um, your edges, when you are close around your edges, and take the hair as small as possible. It's going to make it a lot easier when you're trying to pull it through, because you don't want to be rough. So now I'm gonna go ahead and cut and separate the curls as much as I can and cut for a more natural look um so yeah guys basically that that's all um I hope you guys like this video and don't forget to give me a thumbs up um if you have any comments um please leave a comment please leave it down below um and I'll see you guys in my next video now the next clip is gonna be two days later since um i installed the hair so it looking pretty good to me um i hope you guys like this video like i said don't forget to give me a thumbs up leave a comment down below and i'll see you guys in my next one love you guys and thanks for watching bye